what do you think about this look right here? This is how he looks currently, I think. It looks and, uh, legit. Legit, huh? <laughs> 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 I don't think he dyes his hair though. I don't think it's his real hair, bro. I think everything is fake. <laughs> it looks so like fake. A, well, we used to have this thing called I think it was called Floby. You spray your hair, like spray uh, paint. Yeah. In yeah. The front. yeah. That shit won't work here because it's too hot and humid. Like, bro, I got like a bald spot and it uh-huh. kind of annoys me, but like maybe if I'm like really rich and I, it's like, it's like, it's like nothing, maybe yeah. in like a whim, like getting a tattoo, I might get it fixed. But I think, bro, if you're going to cover that up or going to try to adjust that or something, that's probably fucking gay, bro. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's like, right. it's like so unimportant. I know it can feel bad, but like I can see guys who's trying to comb their hair over it, or like, or like <laughs> going sh- jumping through hoops to not be bald, and it's stupid, bro. <laughs> like, that, like, he, like he said, like uh, Prince uh, Pippin Capri said, he's like some some of these these pimps they need to just let her go. Let yeah, the, let, go. let it go. Bro. Don't let the hairline go. Yeah, let the hair go. Just the way it is. Own it. <laughs> yeah. But if you shave your head, you, you said before you're gonna look like what's his name, Ed Norton, on uh, <laughs> <laughs> American History X. Yeah. yeah, I can go bald. My girlfriend doesn't like it, but it's okay. Yeah, I kind of liked it actually. What happened that one time you went to the Moroccan to see the Moroccan? Oh, you went with the Moroccan friends to get your haircut or something? What do you mean? So like way back? Club, right? Oh no, that was in like a black hairdresser, bro. Uh huh. It started up well, pretty cool. One, yeah, it started up pretty cool, and like in like twenty minutes in, I was like, "Oh, this looks pretty dope." But then, but then he went all in and made like yep. all the lines and make it way too short, and you know, like working another forty minutes on it, I looked like a fucking idiot, bro. I looked like vanilla ice on crack or something. <laughs> oh, fuck it. Yeah. It's not for me. I I look really weird when when you yeah. shave away the sides only. I look like. Ukrainian. Now, when you went into that barber shop, were you the only non-black person there? Yeah, but I was with a guy who was allegedly a drug dealer who I allegedly helped out sometimes. Allegedly. Okay. Why <laughs> half the people there were? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> allegedly. <laughs> they were allegedly. <laughs> <laughs> Could we get a T-shirt? Allegedly, merch. That's the first merch. Allegedly, I don't. Because I, I know the like growing up, I've been going to the. Because I was like mixed. I'm a fish and an octopus, biracial. Yeah. Right. So, so one of the ways I guess my mom felt like for me to compete, not compete, <laughs> for against. <laughs> it was still like you know. You were me, already me. in the black pill community back then. Right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, with my. Ethnic background, yeah. Um, black, black squid. One way she had me like connect with my uh, other side. The other side was to go to these black barbershops to get my hair cut. Plus, most of these white barbershops they couldn't. They don't know how to cut curly hair, like kinky hair and shit. So, so what did you do to connect to the other side then? Just go to the what? No, the other side. Did I go? Not what to the barbershop side. Oh, just going to the barbershop. That's what. I'm no, saying. I mean the other side, the Mexican side. Uh, I went to the laundry man on Sunday <laughs> in, my, in my communion outfit. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, um, now, nah, but just going to the barbershop was, was cool because you get to hear all the conversations. So it's like, that's like the meetup spot. Where yeah, yeah, yeah. Talking about what's trending and stuff. Yeah. That was cool. We don't know that. Cool. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So let's, let's go. This is come town shit. Team Seagal. When you go to a, like a, when you go to like a, uh, a white hairdresser, he's probably yeah. just gonna lay his dick on your shoulder and cut your hair. Uh, that's what, what yeah, what probably in, uh, in Netherlands. Holland. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the one in America will just rub up against you, and act allegedly. Like they're trying to get, get that part, you know, the edge up, gotta get real yeah. close. <laughs> anyway, this is, this is going off the deep end, allegedly.